In our top story tonight, in June, Governor Greg Gianforte highlighted a nearly 11,000% increase in fentanyl seizures in Montana. And now Flathead County is seeing a new deadly drug cocktail sparking concern in the community. I took a trip up to the Flathead to see the impacts of these drugs. The Flathead County Sheriff's Office launched the To Try Is To Die campaign as a deadly new drug combo is hitting the market. Officials say education and awareness is needed to combat what's become a dangerous and deadly mixture of fentanyl and xylazine. So I packed up to speak directly with Sheriff Brian Hino about what's happening. Uh, representatives are now looking at uh, increasing the penalties for uh, the sale of fentanyl. Um, so all of those different things I think are uh, where we're coming to the community saying we are greatly concerned, we want them educated, we want people talking about it, we want them talking to their kids, their families. Xylazine is a new wrinkle in the fentanyl crisis. It's an animal tranquilizer, not approved for use in humans. But people are mixing it with fentanyl, creating troubling new problems. Hino says Narcan won't reverse an overdose when the drugs are taken together. That's because xylazine isn't an opioid. Can you kind of go into the other side effects that may come with this new cocktail? Uh, they call it a zombie drug. They call it trank. They call it all these different things because uh, it not only affects your, sometimes your respiratory or heart rates, but it also can affect the rest of your body. Well, that could be um, you know, the loss of an arm. That could be a tissue damage. I think they're just, just, just atrocious things that um, you know, we don't want to see our community members be affected by. This all comes as fentanyl statistics are skyrocketing. I looked into numbers from the Northwest Montana Drug Task Force, and the findings highlight a sharp increase in seizures of fentanyl and opioid overdose deaths. It's scary in the fact that we're no longer seizing pills or a couple hundred pills. We're seizing pounds of pills, the fourth leading cause of accidental deaths in the state of Montana. Authorities seized 2,000 fentanyl pills in 2021, and that number jumped to over 39,000 pills in 2022. And another startling number we're tracking alongside that, a 39% increase of unintentional fatal opioid overdoses. Uh, when we start to see deaths of individuals, young individuals, old individuals, it has no, um, it doesn't care how old or young or how rich or how poor you are. This drug is one of those that will um, affect many of us. I'll continue working for you following this zombie drug in the flathead, bringing you an update when the Northwest Montana Drug Task Force releases its quarter two report.